Good evening, everyone. My name is Retro Gamer. We are me, my wife, my buddy, right over there, and his wife are all visiting a cemetery in the middle of Longview, Texas. We are going to possibly do a spirit box session in the or near the mausoleum but we are most definitely going to try to avoid stepping on any graves because that's a bad idea period <clears throat> why don't y'all follow us on this journey it's kind of sad to see things like that knocked over Very sad. Oh, that is my wife. Have you just read the, the plots I was talking to you all about? The military? Is it one of the sectioned off sections? It's over there. Alright. It's sectioned off. Hunter, come here, baby. Well, I don't know. I know. It broke Hunter. in my hand. Hunter, come here. Come this way. I'm gonna, come yeah, this way. I want to show you. Okay. Where the, mili the military ones are. Do you know how old they are? Uh, don't I don't know. Like Civil War era, or... <laughs> okay. Hunter, come here. 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 Come to where the players club is. Players club? That's what's over there. Oh. It's just a bar. But I, I think it's like a exclusive bar. And look at that. Either damaged by the elements or damaged by some... Vandalism. Vandalism, yeah. That would be my best guess. That's what I'm thinking. What's the date? 19 something. 1904. Yeah, 1904 for that grave. That one right there. It's a really peaceful cemetery while you're out in the day. Even at night, I mean, it's incredible. What is his name? Thank you for this. This is our newest first episode. We're here gathered here in a cemetery right behind O'Reilly's over here on Highway 80 in Longview, Texas. As you can see, it's quite peaceful even though it's off a major highway. And uh, we're going to go ahead and give you a tour of the place let you see. If anything happens, hey, let it be. So strap on. Damn it, ready. there's a mosquito on my face. You and your mosquitoes. Tell Maddie to get it off. Son of a ah. bitch. Oh yeah. Mosquitoes are terrible. This was an old video. I was if you don't have them up north, then you can bite me. <laughs> I'm pretty sure they're everywhere, but that's not the point. Ooh. No, what happened to the flowers? They got blown away from their grave. Where y'all going? It looks like someone like drove down in here. Dude, they pull bulldozers, all sorts of stuff down here to bury the body. No, like right here, someone. Need to stay here, respect the dead. Who? Whoever. Get off that grave, then. I'm not on the grave. Jackhole. <laughs> Damn, that was hot. Oh shit. Mm. You know you got to bleep that out now that you did with YouTube, right? Nope. Oh my gosh, and all them do it. Jesus. Now you gotta pay him money because you said there's said his name in it. <laughs> I'm gonna give a shout out to Omar Gosh. Y'all find his channel with his name and give him a few likes Omar Gosh TV. and views. We haven't met him personally. We wish we to. Wish. Eventually we might. We're hoping that, you know. Maybe he'll come to Texas. Maybe. Maybe. And maybe we could do a video with him if we get big enough. We can hope. 
So like us on YouTube, people. Come on now, like, like us. Like and subscribe, guys. Come subscribe. on. Subscribe. You know, push that little button at the bottom. Push that subscription button and the notification button if you like the video. The only reason we're doing a video during the day is because my camera sucks at night. Those three flags? Yeah. She picked one of them up and got a shock. Well, it sounds like someone was telling her something. Can we? Placards? I don't know. No, I mean, like, are you talking about placards yeah. or just the name tags in general? Well, they could have been, like, those that couldn't be identified due to circumstances. Oh, 05 to 83? Damn, he lived a good life. Long life. Nice. Come on. Dang it. I'm going to have to block out that name, the Jenkins. I'm going to have to block that out. I gotta be careful. I almost walked on two graves. Hey. I'm wondering what happened to that tree and why it's leaning like that. You would be the one to wonder it. I mean, look at it. It looks like it's grown that way. Like it got blown over one day and it just started growing out. I know this is as far as Brittany and I've gone. You didn't go any farther in? Mm -mm. We went all the way up to that little road right there and that was it. Wow. It's time to go visit the mausoleum. <laughs> well, we've got our spirit box. We could, if you want. Come. Let us venture forth into the wild blue yonder. Look, we're not in the air, okay? We're not flying planes. No, but you still wobble you under look. We're not in the ground either. <laughs> We're not in the ground, no. Thank God for small favor. Wild brown number. Or uh, yonder. Damn. You Wild really brown can't number. Come up with that, can you? Oh, I can't talk today, okay? You can't talk anytime. Bite me. That's my job. <laughs> <laughs> God bless you, my dear. Thank you. Look at that. Look at the kitty head. Come here. <laughs> Number one rule, I'm always right. That one's right. Those two? Those two grave three graves. Okay, good. There's a date, 1878 to 1969. And there's older. No names. Well, I guess first names could be could be used. <clears throat> Alan. Jackie. What? Mr. Gray ain't gonna be mad about it. I didn't do it. Dorian Gray? I guess you looked at his picture too long. <laughs> oh my gosh. Corny jokes, we know. It's okay though. Shut up, you're full of them. I'm full of dad jokes, bite me. Full of what? Dad jokes. What the hell is a dad joke? Really, really corny jokes. You're good at it. That one is sinking in already. It's been there for a minute. This one? This one right here, it's been there for a minute. Because it's sinking. The, Talking about the, the dirt sinking and settling. Yeah. But those, are, those are new over there. You can tell they are. I really want to go there and fix those flowers. Like, it's... The groundskeepers here don't take good care of these. these See, I could do this. See, I think all they do is just rake up or blow the leaves everywhere. Because when we, <clears throat> Brittany and I walk through here, 
David didn't even come down and miss any of the mud grass. Crap, I'm going to have to edit your shirt out because it's Disney. Disney's a dick. Um, they only they only mow up there. They wouldn't mow down here. It's because of all the ruts in them. It don't matter. They're still part of the cemetery. No, I understand. What, the? what buddy? Go. You're sure it's okay to have him in the video? We're not going to have any problems from... Okay. No, I'm referring to the others that think they need to have some involvement in his life. Even though they have no rights. Good. Put the rocks down. Give me your hand. That boy's going to be straight up red-headed. Golly. No first names. <laughs> Not on that one, at least. Probably already going to have to edit out a lot of stuff. So it's okay though. Completely edit me out if you want. I don't know I'll just put like a a thing over your face every time we see you. One of those uh. Yeah, that way you can call me the blankouts. Bat yeah, we can call me the Batman, and they can't figure out what we're like. Or we could call you faceless. One of the two. Nah. <laughs> You are that weird go, dude. The Batman. I'm Alan. The Batman. There you go. No, no, because the name Batman is copyrighted. We can't do that. DC might sue us. That's why you have people call themselves a Joker, for God's sake, but that's copyrighted, too. We're on video, though. And so are they. And... I don't know. We could try it. Alright, that's enough. Come on. You okay? Connor, quit freaking out. Hey, look at that. Look. Look. Oh. Screw it, I'll leave your shirt in. Come here, honey. <laughs> Not a problem. I mean, it can't really see the name. This boy is tough as shit. Oh. Not, not, no, no. Because tough as shit is really soft. This boy is tough as nails. Let's say that. Yeah, stay back here with us, Bubba. Oh, no wings. <laughs> no wings. Shit. Oh, no. Oh, no. Did you get, did you ever figure out how to delete the other videos? No. Damn it. Come here. Hold on. Okay, sorry about that pause. Or that change in scenery. I had to make some space. <clears throat> Anyways. Can you hold this, please? Okay, so the whole reason, the whole reason we chose this cemetery is because it's right in the middle of town, public access, we can pretty much do anything we want here and not get in trouble by the cops, as long as it's not vandalism or destructive in any nature. So, of course, then again, this is talking about us, this is talking about him. Sometimes things happen. I can't say very much. So if anything, we ask for forgiveness and we're sorry. Have a nice day. What the hell are you talking about? How are we destructive? What did we do to be destructive? I never said that we we're doing it right now. I just said it might happen. <laughs> Your husband's weird. The pots? What, you're not here? She said plots, man, with an L. My hearing is fucked up, okay? Oh, I gotta edit that out. My hearing is bad, okay? No, no, let me see it. And of course, there's a train. What? I don't care. We're about to enter a grove of trees. The grove looks awful. I didn't notice that. Yeah, right no next names. to the trash can. No names. There is no name on it, dude. Up here. I can't, in other words, you can't see it on here. Okay. Yeah, they, they have one right next to the trash cans. That ought to tell you how good that person was. Wow. 
so it could be someone. Oh, that could have been a screw up. Like they lived longer than they thought they would, so they had to get rid of the headstone. Because that is a smart thing to do. Remember, we live in Long Beach, Texas. No names! <laughs> no, no people's names. I don't care. And here is the grove of trees. Planted beautifully in the middle of the gra graveyard. Well, able to be walked under as if they grew to look over anyone who walketh by. So look that's what people got married in this area. Well, that would kind of explain some things around yeah. here, seriously. Well, I mean, if you look right, you can see those bushes down that way kind of arch over. Yeah. Like the sun You're will... <laughs> Like the sun goes, does the arch over that in that direction, so it makes sense. Cause and you can see the, the sun and all that going down, and how dark it's getting. Yeah. So, retro gamer, how are we doing it today? How am I doing today? Yes. Aside from almost passing out driving to work, uh, pretty good. Go to sleep more, asshole. I'll throw. Good. I can't promise anything. Yeah. My name ain't Rachel Grandma for nothing. I can't I'm trying to figure out a good name for me. We'll figure one out. Then we can edit it into the video. That worked! Psycho. Why not just the Joker? Okay! I didn't know that too. Why not Batman? Because Psycho Batman is just like saying you're the Joker. Yeah, I like Psycho Batman better. Alright, I'll work with Psycho Batman. Psycho Batman! There you go. His I name is Psycho Batman. Psycho Batman. Psycho Batman. Ah! <laughs> yeah, it's actually really peaceful even though it's right in the middle of town. Which is a very scary disposition by itself because it's right in the middle of town. I told you we had some people buried here a couple of days ago. across the way and one right there. Okay, so I'm gonna walk. Watch where you're walking. I'm watching. Hey, man. What? Make sure walk in between. There's a new one. Looks like there's a new one right over there, too. Always walk in between the graves. You're not walking on them. If you walk anywhere within a six to seven foot section in front of them, you're walking on the grave. And that will piss off the spirits. <coughs> Does that say what I think? It no. Okay. I thought I said Maddie. Um, sometimes both. Hey, hey, that crypt right there is dirty as shit. It's, it's a, a crypt. crypt. Oh. We took a first? took a video of it. Oh, we going? Yeah. Are we going? Yeah. We staying? Playing with ourselves? What's up? Well, I mean. Hey, hey. That's right there, that big brick thing? That's above ground. They didn't bury me in the ground. Oh. Must have done something real bad. Either that or the family wanted it that way. I think the family requested like that because of the bloody Ah. That makes sense. You know, all those bodies that washed up in Louisiana due to the Hurricane too. Yeah. That's still pretty bright on the camera right now. That's good. Ladies and gentlemen, this is a testament to monuments everywhere.
smallest house you'll ever see with two doors with windows in it. I guess because they wanted to have the dead look out the window. I haven't got a clue. Well, I mean, it's kind of... Do they go in there? Are they in there? Yeah, they're in there. Oh, yeah. They're in, like, the wall or something. Yeah, yeah. yeah they're in each side of the wall. Hey, if you think I'm going to go in there and open that door, you're nuts. I would do it. I don't I think would. he can open the door. Grab no. Because... <laughs> Hunter, stay here. No, honey. I mean, I think it's locked. Hunter, stay here. Stay here. Stay with us. Mimi will be back. I'm right here, buddy. Come in. I don't know. We'll go right here. <laughs> yeah, like I said, I think it's locked. So... Someone's trying to dig out of that grave. Oh, probably. Zombies are going to attack. Oh, Shh, God. don't tell anybody else. Hey, be quiet because we got our own place already. Well, don't say that. Possibly. Highly. Okay. Well, I mean, it's peaceful, so... I want to do something cool with this video, man. You want to what? I want to do something cool with this video, come on. Like what? This is what I want in the show. Um, I actually sat here today. Are we going over there? Yes. I thought you wanted to do it. freaking dark. Okay, so that's the mausoleum we're going to go to here in a little bit. First, my buddy here, Psycho Batman, wants to do something. Looks like there's another grave that's been... That one looks like it's been a little bit... Freshly done right over there, if you can see it. Interesting. And now the video starts getting dark because we go into a dark area. Never drink hot coffee right out the pot. Mm, damn. Burned my tongue. So, people have actually been putting solar lights out here on the graves, as you can see. And the fact that they're bright right now tells you that they've been charging all day. The do is, actually, talking to some of the people who know of the, of the, of the certain lights, they have actually said the fact that the reason why the lights are out here is because the children like to roam around at night. He's talking. That the lights are up so they won't be afraid of the dark when they are up. So Interesting. If you look around, you can see the fact that all the lights and all the solar power things. And coming out here one, two o'clock in the morning, you will know the fact that you can hear children laughing every once in a while and hear them giggle. So they keep the lights on. <clears throat> so that the children around here will not have to be afraid of the dark. You want to know what they're doing? I guarantee you I know what they're doing. They're playing hide and go seek in the dark. Probably. <laughs> Best damn game to ever play in the dark. Sweet. I'm gonna have to edit that question out. You realize that, right? I don't give a fuck. You don't have to edit half of this shit out. <laughs> but that's actually what I've been told. Is the reason why they've done it. Cool. <clears throat> yeah, I wanted I'm to get that done before it got dark because I wanted them to see it, but see everything around it too. Yeah. Well, I mean, now that we're out here right after the sun went down, that's a good thing because those things are brighter as opposed to how dim they are whenever we, we come out here at 10. Time. Yeah. The batteries don't last long on those things at all. No. 
and it kills me. I want that especially done because that way people can understand the history. They can understand the stories that are behind everything here. Yeah. You know, you've got a lot of situations going on here. We've also been told the fact that there is a serial killer that was buried here. Mind you, I'm not really too sure where he's at. Right over there. Oh, so we did find him. No, the spirits told us. Well, that kind of explains a lot. Yeah. So, but. Spirit box session. I'll put that video in with this one and let y'all hear some of the word or some of the stuff they told us. But we're about to do another one, so maybe we'll get another answer. And they are over there just looking through the graves. I told you what I wanted to do with some of this was to actually bring life to it. Put history in it. Exactly. Yep. Okay, let's... Not, not, not just sit here and go, okay, just something happened. No. Okay. Hey, we're going to head over to the uh, mausoleum. Okay. It's almost getting too dark for the video camera, by the way. Didn't they have lights in the mausoleum front? Nope. Oh, shit. Well, actually, there's a motion sensor light on the mausoleum front. <coughs> and it kind of turned on while we were out here the other day. Out of nowhere. Yeah. So, kind of... Well, it didn't really freak me out, it just... Are you? A little bit startled. I'll admit it, I get freaked out sometimes. The lights you're seeing are just some of the lights of the businesses around here. We it's gotta... pretty quiet. It usually doesn't, the disturbances usually doesn't start until about, for one of them to explain, about mm, one o'clock in the morning. You have a lot of people who come through here just because it's quiet, they don't have to worry about traffic and everything else through here, and heard some pretty gory tales. And it's pretty quiet, so sleeping is a good option too. However, this park does close, and yes, I said park because for some reason on the sign that tells you what time the cemetery closes, they call it a park. Anyways. Which is very strange to me, by the way. Even Psycho Batman can't figure that one out. This park does close at 11 o'clock p.m. Not a.m. That would be stupid. But it closes at 11 p.m. The mausoleum itself actually closes at 5 p.m. So they come out here and they chain up the doors. That way nobody can vandalize the... Uh... <sighs> vandalize any of the things on the inside. Right? Wow. That feeling is just... That's like a big major feeling of dread. What the hell is what it is. Oh yeah, I saw this last night. Grace Hill Mausoleum, Inc. was disbanded many years ago leaving continued maintenance of building to the crypt owners. The city of Longview has no interest or responsibility to this building. Please show respect for the families here by taking the proper action to correct the problem you see one. The ongoing participation from all crypt owners is appreciated. And what's sad to me is that it's a mausoleum in the middle of a city, in a city's cemetery. But the city doesn't want to maintain the mausoleum themselves. Yeah. Hey, buddy! That's something I don't understand. This is a tall mausoleum, too. Oh. 
All right, so who wants to ask the questions? Our How about what Maddie does? Is she's so good at things and pushing people about doing stuff. Our next adventure, it'd be the cemetery of my dad. Which one was that one? I'm not that the one. one. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> kind of like Popper's Field Cemetery? Well, it's or uh, Poppy Field? It's Dallas Whatever Fort Worth National Cemetery. This might be a little bright. There you go. <laughs> yep, you're wearing sunglasses in the middle of the night. So, He's your father's there. grave is in Dallas, yes. Fort Worth area. It's the Dallas. Okay. I mean, we can get the money up for it. I mean, they've got some more out there that it's you and they got it out there. Cool. So. Swing with me, bub. All right. It's like a Batman town with anything. Batman. That's right, Batman. Okay, so. Come here. Uh uh. Mimi needs you now. Go to Mimi. Come here. Do we want him? I'm gonna set him up. Anywhere near the spirit box. Set him up here. Okay. I'll take it over here. I guess I'm doing this. Uh, wow! Well, I was wanting everybody else to do questions too, because last time I'm the one who did the questions. Spirit box. Spirit box. Are we safe? Good question. Are we safe? I haven't started yet. Well, then get started. Spanky. You're going to have to turn it up. I had to turn it down while I was at work. Okay. What in the name of hell is that? Question. I'll turn the light on. Is there someone here? I think someone just said you in a very sarcastic way. Can you talk? No! That's what it sounded like to me. What's your name? Is there more than one of you? I hear music, man. It uses radio waves to do the EVPs. The way I see it, the way this is this works, hold on just a minute. It uses the radio waves like a white noise. like a white noise and they pull whatever words they're trying to use from the ether or from the microwaves that's the way I see it we, me and my husband were here the other night are you glad we're back? that was the yes uh, I believe it <laughs> we brought a few extra friends do you like them? That's all I heard. That's I mean, the voice we got the other night. That was the female voice we got. Huh? Are we in danger? No. Are we talking to the... Are one of the spirits that are talking with us the serial killer? Thank you. Is my grandson being watched over? That was a very faint voice. We haven't had that yet. Is her grandson in danger? 
Yes or no? Yes or no? Yes? Maybe, I think is what it said. No. Does it sound like a maybe to y'all? Can you say that one more time? Is he in danger? Yes or no? Was that a yes? Yes. What's he in danger for? There it is. Look at this. The light comes on finally. What is he in danger of? How is he in danger? So he's not in danger. Okay, good. Are any of us in danger? Apologize for the erratic movements. Did you just make that light flicker? Whoa! I think it was a no. Papa, I'm gonna hold your hand! I'm gonna hold your hand! I need to pause real quick. So, I'm gonna give a little backstory. About two years ago, or a year ago, Two years ago, my younger brother committed suicide. We did an EVP or a uh, spirit box session. At 3 a.m. at our house. It wasn't at 3 a.m. It was more. It was close to 3 a.m., but it wasn't at 3 a.m. And my brother talked to me. I was a skeptic of the spirit box at first. But when he talked to me, I was ending the spirit box session, and I told him I loved him, and he said, I love you too, bro. Or, I love you, bro. So, since that day, I've been a believer. What? Was it the other way around? Okay, I told him I love you, bro, and he said, love you? I love you, too. Okay. Are you okay? She's come back. She's, she's not very good. <clears throat> okay, ladies and gentlemen. It is too dark for my camera right now. Hopefully, at some point in the future, we can get a camera that has, like, night vision or something. That way we can do night videos. We wanted to get here early in the day, though. That way we could get some footage of the cemetery. So, this is Retro Gamer. One second. We're fixing to leave. Do you have anything else to say? Anything else to say, guys? Come on. Speak now or forever hold your peace. Or at least until the next time we come out. And bye. Have a All good right. night. Have a good night. You too. From everyone here. Psycho Batman, his wife, my wife, and Retro Gamer here. Have a good night. You best believe it.